I'm Laura H. Jpeck, and this is my studio. Uh, in general, uh, the work that I'm working on now deals a lot with an exterior facade that is calculated, I suppose. I investigate how one can construct a facade via what they wear, um, as well as um, people, uh, what people can see on the internet without doing very much. Certainly, my information is gathered from Facebook, Google. All my friends who are on Facebook are, are pretty much fair game for me to gather information from, so I'll take those and I, I concentrate on portraiture on how obsolete exteriors are to really telling any true information about who a person is. Mostly light, I think. I'm really drawn to um, the way that light plays objects, but also the way that light can emanate from a computer screen. I'm inspired by web design and, and grids. I make art because it's really the only thing that I'm good at. <laughs> ah, that's a good question. Um, I... I choose to do most of my work in the uh, printmaking medium because it's easier for me to know where to start. There's a definite process and that definite process is kind of like the shot at the beginning of the race. When I look at a blank piece of paper to draw upon, I don't typically have anything um, that urges me forward that says, all right, go. I have a difficult time putting something directly on the paper so when I can fool around on a matrix, it gives me a, a place to start. I know I know that there's a process that I can become invested in. Also, I'm fearless and there's no going back in printmaking. When I'm procrastinating, <laughs> I have wonderful studio mates and the, the wonderful thing about printmaking is that you, uh, you typically share a studio, particularly when you're in school. Unfortunately, when, when the other people are around, it's very easy to turn up the music and run around the studio like maniacs, and um, pretty much that's what happens when I'm in here but not making work. Oh my god, this is embarrassing. Um, I'm afraid of taxidermy to animals. When I was eight years old, a uh, stuffed bison fell on me. I've kind of been traumatized. Going to grad school, I think, is, is probably the biggest risk that I've ever taken. Oh my god. Um, it was either a no doubt CD, this is so shameful, or a handsome CD. I loved Taylor Hanson. I was only good at a couple other things, um, so I would probably be some sort of educator or a computer programmer. I like this question. Um, Pollock. I hate Pollock. I hate Pollock because it's just too damn easy. <laughs> My plan is to find a Dick's Sporting Goods in the middle of a tiny, tiny suburb in the middle of the mountains somewhere and take all the cliff bars up to the rafters with me with several canoes and kayaks and stretch them perpendicular across those beams and live up there because I'm perfectly canoe-sized. Yes! <laughs> My name is Laura H. Drapak, and you can find out more about my artwork on my website, laurahdrapak.com.